Creativity is an addiction. Unplug because we will always say yes to creativity. Totally uncut because we all make mistakes. So turn it into a tool. This is Arrow Unplugged. Stream thinking. Learning how to trust what's in your present. To get there requires practice. Here's how I do it. One sheet a day, 10 minutes. I write about whatever is moving through my presence of right now with absolutely no judgment. Stream thinking sharpens your skills as a listener, as a communicator, and as an activator. Learning how to trust what is right now. This is stream thinking. May 6, 2023. This is one of those moments where stream thinking became a page in history. Not really big history, but it's history. I don't know where I'll be when I return to this page, but it should be written that this is no ordinary moment. On this day, May 6, 2023, the King Charles III coronation is playing on my giant flat screen TV. The videos and photographs will last longer than seven generations. We can only assume that the world is actually watching. If not, there'll be YouTube and TikTok videos. But will it be the same? Even as a writer, I can't fully bring to the readers the enormous sounds of music being brought to life. Whoa, the royal carriage has just been displayed on the left side of the screen. Living in what is right now comes with a journey. And as an American daily writer, what does any of this even mean? And wouldn't it be great if our nation showed this much unity during the changing of leadership? That's not political. I'm just saying what goes on in your life becomes a page in someone else's history. How you got to your moment of right now involved those long before you. But do you know their story? Do you know what was going on and what was required for you to have what you've got or what you don't have right now? And we tend to lean on those moments more than than the victories because we go, oh, well, I would be if this wouldn't have happened. Well, you can't change that because it's already happened. Being a daily writer gives me the opportunity to look inside the questions and then questioning the answers. And the reason why I write daily is not necessarily for me. People go, oh, it's good therapy. Okay, I guess I've been doing it for 29 years. I guess it's good therapy. But more importantly, I'm going to give my grandchildren and their grandchildren something that my grandparents and even mom and dad didn't give me an opportunity to take something like the King Charles III coronation on May 6, 2023. And I'm saying here, this is for you. I fell witness to it and I just wanted you to just experience it the way that you're going to interpret it. I'm Errol and that's Stream Thinking.